Hello sisters, friends. So here we are. We have been journeying together, looking at hospitality. We've been together on the road to Emmaus. We have, um, we've entertained angels unaware. We have encountered the Good Shepherd in Psalm 23. We have been to the cross where we have witnessed Jesus reaching out to a death row inmate saying, today you will be with me in paradise. And then we were with the disciples in John's gospel when Jesus promises, I go to prepare a place for you that where I am, you may be also. Now we close with the words from 1 Peter. Above all, maintain constant love for one another. Be hospitable to one another without complaining. Listen, hospitality isn't just hard work. It is also heart work. Fortunately, hospitality, hospitality like anything else, gets easier with practice. I'm sure you've heard the phrase, give until it hurts. You know, my pastor, Pastor Helen King Hollingsworth, she used to tell me, give until it doesn't. And so with practice, we can become more like uh, the gospel example of hospitality. It may not come to us naturally, but it can come to us supernaturally through the Holy Spirit. Gracious hospitality is the heartbeat of community. Gracious hospitality is an act of worship that glorifies God. In fact, here's a helpful way to think about hospitality. True hospitality does not come from me, but rather through me. Hospitality is a gift of the Holy Spirit. We are merely the conduit for this gift that keeps on giving. Come on here. Blessed to be an instrument of God's bottomless hospitality. Indeed, my sisters, my friends, there is plenty good room in my father's house. I invite you to pray with me. The Lord be with you and also with you. Let us pray. Loving God. Thank you for being patient with us as we live into our baptismal calling to work for justice and peace. Continue to teach us what it means to be good stewards of your spacious grace. Strengthen us to practice bottomless hospitality to all of your good creation. Empower us to maintain love for one another above all else. In Jesus' name, amen.